Nation food. Welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are doing well today and you are ready to get into some fashion, honey. So let's go ahead and get into it. So if you are new here, welcome. My name is Ashley. I make plus size fashion and lifestyle videos for you guys to enjoy. And we always keep it connected over here. So don't forget to subscribe and definitely hop in the comments, girl, because I like to have conversation with y'all in the comments. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and hop in the comments and subscribe. So you can stay as you may see by the title today we are going to get into another how to dress your shape video and this one is going to be some plus size looks that are very big belly friendly um as you guys know i am more of an apple shape like the larger i get the more apple shape that i am shaped <laughs> we'll just leave it at that so yeah i have a bigger belly and i like to dress in the way that makes me feel comfortable with the size of my belly while it's not accentuating my belly so First and foremost, real quick, I do not dress most of the time in a way that hides my belly, but I dress my full body in a way that makes me feel comfortable with my belly and how I look overall. So some of these looks may or may not be something that you're interested in. I know some people are not interested in um, longer crop tops with higher waist pants because you still feel like you see the belly. I get that. Um, but this is not the time for you to come and tell me I need to hide my belly because I don't. And this is something I like to do to show other people another way to dress their body without feeling like you have to hide yourself, but you can feel comfortable in the body that you're in today. So that is the goal that I've been doing with my wardrobe. Some of these, again, items may not be something that you feel comfortable in, but if you want to look at it to kind of get an understanding of where I'm coming from, then definitely do so um and those that are on the same stride as me and have the same style that i am achieving um then yeah girl this is the place for you so let's go ahead and get into these eight looks y'all know i got my handy dandy phone <laughs> i got to keep abreast of how and when i'm showing you guys what i'm showing you okay so the first look is my absolute favorite look i love um these color combinations for fall I, it is actually a jumpsuit that I got from Boohoo, I want to say last year in November or October. And so this particular color they're sold out of, but they have another one in the same color um, with longer sleeves. So it's if it's a cooler day, you can still pair it with this cardigan from Walmart, as well as the same color um, jumpsuit that give, has the like tracksuit lines on the side and everything. Um, so I'm showing you a reel on this side for, so you can see how I put it together. And then at the end, I will show you a picture of the overall look. So so I love the rust brown or the rust orange look with the cardigan paired with my J. Crew bag. So cute. And then you still have hints of that same color at the bottom of the J. Crew shoes. So this entire um, outfit is given, honey, we dropping the kids off at school or we got some errands to run. Very comfortable, but giving a chic play on brown tones. So I really, really love this outfit. I thought it was really cute. And the top is long enough for you to allow the shirt to still hang out. Um, and it's not cons it's not like accentuating your belly is as I'm saying, but it is a thinner fabric. If you do get this exact jumpsuit, it comes in three colors, this color black, and I want to say gray. But if you get the other jumpsuit that is longer sleeves, it is a thicker fabric. I can tell from the picture that is thicker than this. Um, so you will have that different play in fabric depending on which one you decide to purchase if you don't have something like this already at the house and you want to try to achieve this look. So this is my favorite, favorite look, giving you mom on the go, auntie in motion, uh, cousin with the little cousins out and about. Like it's just giving you so much cuteness and I think it's a really cute plus size outfit. Perfect for fall, perfect for fall. Before I get into the next outfit, I want to let you guys know that I am wearing a shaper in every single one of these outfits. So I'm going to show you the reel of me putting the outfits together and the picture. A shaper is worn in every single one of them. I wear the Spanx Thin Stinks shaper because it's so thin. Um, it's breathable, so I'm not suffocating here in Houston because it gets on the hot on a regular basis. <laughs> um, so I'm not suffocating, but it also gives me the hold and control that I'm looking for without showing underneath my clothes. So even in the thin fabric from the last outfit that I showed you guys you could not see the shaper where it started and where it stopped that's how thin that shaper is but it is perfect 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 I love it it's easy to put on I'm a size 22 24 and I'm wearing a 3x in the thin stinks shaper so I'm gonna have all of this stuff linked for you guys underneath the video in the description so the next outfit is a very casual look. It's very on the go as well. A lot of these outfits are more just like throw on and on the go. It's like 
uh, outfits that you can give a really good look without putting in a whole lot of effort or at least not looking like you put in a whole lot of effort because you plan these ahead of time, <laughs> period. But this outfit is actually um, just a bodycon midi dress. And as you guys know, I typically try to stay away from any bodycon dresses. But this particular dress uh, feels good to me to wear because it feels comfortable. It's not hugging my stomach. Um, and then in the way that I wear this dress, most of the time it's layered with something over it. So it's a long sleeve dress. You could do a short sleeve dress. This is a rib dress. I want to say I got it from ASO. So I'm trying, I'm going to try to look for the exact, if not very similar dress on ASOS. And I love the length that it comes on me. Again, the shaper is worn on here. And I'm wearing my black and white dunks, Nike dunks, um, the high top version that I got from GOAT. I got this from the GOAT app. I know uh, some of you sneakerheads out there probably know that it's like sold out in a lot of other places, but the GOAT app has uh, various vendors, I wanna say. I don't know who it's really grabbing it from, but they do a check for you guys for authenticity purposes. Mm. Girl, I lost that word. <laughs> They do an authentic check before they ship it to you. My sneakerhead friends and family actually told me about the GOAT app and it's, uh, they had my size. I wear a men's eight and a half um, and women's 10. So I went ahead and got that. It's a, it's a good price to me I because I feel like I will wear them to the wheels fall off. <laughs> That's how I am about so many of my things. Um, so yeah, I got these from the GOAT app. So it's going to be linked directly from the GOAT app, um, but it is still a reward style or LTK link. Um, so don't be afraid to click it when you see it. It doesn't say GOAT.com. It is still from the GOAT app. But um, I paired it with a, of course, my Farfetch uh, or my Marc Jacobs bag from Farfetch, uh, as well as a denim jacket. You can never go wrong with a denim jacket in the in the fall. It's it's on period. Like sometimes it's cool, sometimes it's a little thicker than cool. I don't know. <laughs> sometimes it's cooler than cool. I don't, and you just need something to layer. Uh, you can never go wrong with a nice denim jacket. So I will have that link for you guys in the description as well. Very easy outfit to put together in any like occasion because it's casual, like a casual occasion um, and you feel comfortable in what you're wearing. I have one more dress option for you guys and this is a J. Crew dress. If you are wanting to kind of conceal your stomach, the perfect thing is to make sure you're getting something that lays over it and something that's not cupping under it. You want to allow it to caress over you and not like really grab you and hold on to you, which is why I typically try to stay away from bodycon dresses because they're typically tight. Um, I personally don't feel comfortable in them with my body, just me. So yeah, this dress is more kind of like a skater style dress. You kind of want to stay in those lines. Um, anything that's fitting you more up top and then flaring out so that it caresses your sides and your silhouette without cupping underneath your belly, especially like me, you have a bigger belly. Um, that is something you want to aim more towards when you are picking out dresses. So this outfit is a J. Crew dress. Um, it is a nice Fall, what kind of color is this? It's like a brown gray. I, don't, I had to look at, I have the clothes still hanging up on my rack. But yeah, it's like a brown grayish tone. You don't have to do a lot to dress it up. You can wear it with some tennis shoes. I have J. Crew tennis shoes on over here as well. And they're like, this this particular tennis shoe is so easy to dress up and is very comfortable. Um, so like really on the go type of sneaker. So I think that one is good with the dress as well. You can like kind of, still have a girly look with a dress and add some tennis shoes with it. The cap is from J. Crew as well and so is the bag. The bag actually has a suede or a leather side so it just depends on which side you want to wear it on. Like they're both the same shade it's just the different textures. Um, but yeah that is a cute on the go look as well. Auntie, mommy, cousin, big sis on the go whatever like businesswoman. Very cute style that you can put together but still feel comfortable. So yeah that's that one. Actually none of these outfits have heels this is just not I'm not I'm not there I'm not in the mood I can't I'm not dealing with that right now so all of these are comfortable outfits so now let's go to some blazer options I have this blazer from Eloquy I'm gonna shoot the video over here for you guys um, I have the blazer that I've been I think I've had it for like a year or at least over a year it's a really good kind of cream color blazer and Eloquy has a ton of blazers that not only you can use for casual looks you can also multi-purposely use them <laughs> for any casual looks as well. So I paired the blazer with a Skims bodysuit, y'all. I'm living for Skims. I know some of y'all don't like him. 
that ain't my problem I really like the quality of skim so I'm I'm like really loving this bodysuit I got it in black I got another one of their bodysuits and then some loungewear so anyways this bodysuit feels really good I got that when it's long sleeves but I, long sleeves with s <laughs> long sleeve but I pulled it up underneath the blazer and have the blazer rolled on the like sleeves or whatever um, the jeans are Sofia Vergara jeans from Walmart so you know they're affordable they feel really good I love the um, fray on the knee and how the like boy cut fits and feels on me because I rarely find a good boy cut style jean that feels good to me and actually looks good on me this jean is that jean, these jeans are that something <laughs> Um, but yeah, these jeans feel good in this style. So I kind of rolled them up, wore the J. Crew tennis shoes, as well as a lighter beige uh, color of the same J. Crew bag. Now this bag doesn't have the suede and leather um, option on each side. It's leather the whole way around, but it's a really good tote. So yeah, that's the full outfit. Again, Spanx are worn underneath it, and I don't feel... I, I the bodysuit I honestly don't have it like snapped <laughs> I just like chuck them in in the front and the back because like I don't have time for all that and a shaker but yeah full outfit looks good it's like perfect for the go perfect for on the go there you go <laughs> So the second blazer outfit is very, 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 very similar to the same outfit I wore last year, except I just changed out the shoes, honestly. Um, the blazer is from Eloquy. It's a black and like brown contrast blazer. Love it. It looks rich, expensive. Um, it's perfect for layering, perfect for work, perfect for casual wear, all of that. So I have on a, girl, where did I get this from? Oh, Shein, a Shein white bodysuit that I have under it and some Walmart's joggers. These are sweatpants. Blazer and sweatpants. Yes, honey, look at your Pinterest account. Look up fall looks and stuff like that. The girls are doing it out there. So I just did it on a plus size body and let's see it, you know what I'm saying? Pull them up a little higher, you know, so it's not cupping my stomach. It's actually grazing over my stomach. The sweatpants are a little bigger, which is perfect for this look because I don't want it to fit me. Like I don't want it to hug my stomach or hug my legs and hug my hips. I want it to give the bellowed silhouette that I'm looking for underneath my blazer. So it's perfect. I just have on some um, dad sandals from Target and of course my Marc Jacobs Farfetch bag. Full look, girl, you're just moving about, honey. We are going through these looks pretty quickly. Let's keep it moving. Very comfortable, something you can throw on. Never shy away from sweats and a blazer, which is, you know, bringing me to our next look as well. I have the black blazer from Eloquy. This is another great business and casual option for you guys to use. And the bodysuit, I want to say is an older bodysuit from Just Fab, but I've seen so many duplicates of that square neck long sleeve or mid sleeve or short sleeve bodysuits from Shein. So those are the ones I'm going to link because they're most likely in stock and very affordable. These leggings are from Shein as well. Again, they're a little bigger. When I first put them on, they're kind of not tighter, but they're more fitted. So the more you move around in, in them, the bigger they get, which is perfect for me because I like my sweatpants to be bigger, especially if I'm pairing them with tennis shoes and a blazer or just you know, like casual looking it up you know I don't want my sweatpants to be fitted so <laughs> these are gray sweatpants from Shein and then I paired those same black and white Nike dunks with this outfit looks really cute right like the colors go together you popped in some gray so you're not just black and white all the way through doing a little color blocking and then adding in your nice casual bag got the Marc Jacobs and we're good to go such a cute look. I am just proud of how I'm, I'm doing lately, girl. Fall is inspiring me. The next look is a full head to toe J. Crew outfit. Now, J. Crew goes up to a size 24. I didn't mention that earlier, but if you are comfortable with a more higher price brand, um, it's not extremely luxury, but it's not like walmart when it comes to price tag um so if you are comfortable with investing more in your pieces then j crew is another option for you guys they go up to a size i want to say 20 i want to say it's 24 um and 37 in pants which is equivalent to a 24 so i have this brown like blazer style um coat it's really like a cardigan a sweater cardigan and i kind of rolled up the sleeves in it with 
this pop of green vest which I thought was so cute um, has like a slightly higher neck almost like it's going into a turtleneck but not quite it's really a razor style um, cropped top so I thought that was cute these boyfriend style jeans which also again another jean that I rarely find um, in that cut that fits and looks good on me so the jeans aren't extremely tight to where they're cupping underneath my belly so that's perfect and it's giving that slacked relaxed feel and look but the way you style it gives you more of that effortlessly chic or cute or comfy look without making you feel slouchy and sloppy put on the same j crew um shoes and the beige j crew bag and you got an entire look that pop of color and that brown really kind of helps pulls it together as well as those beiges like you can play around with everything not matching and it still give you a good look and last but not least is a very simple but so cute like night out kind of outfit again flats because we are not in the mood for heels at the moment um i have this long line cardigan that is from walmart paired it with a Shein bodysuit which feels really good on the quality is really good I've had it over for, for over a year no holes no rips no tears no threads um, or like none of that like coming out none of the threadings is coming out or anything like that it's just a really good um, bodysuit and then I have these I think these are JC Penney's ANA jeans which are my favorite jeans just in general <laughs> like they feel really good they're skinny jeans um so they feel really good and they're frayed on the bottom and i think it just makes really nice little pop of hip in this look and then i have these um flat over the knee boots stretch boots from torrid so if it's on a cooler night you go on a night out with the girls you add in some a necklace and some like gold or silver accessories whatever's your steeds um and then you got an entire look but you're comfortable and you still get that girly dressed up effortless like just gorgeous person walking into the building honey yep and that is the final look so i hope you guys enjoyed all eight of those looks i hope i went through every single one of them hold on let me double check <laughs> okay we're good <laughs> i went through every single outfit so i hope you guys enjoyed those looks all of those are big belly friendly again i have like as you can see a bigger belly lower and top because we just i'm not one belly over here i got two got some love handles so they looked good on me so i hope you guys don't feel afraid to try to replicate some of those looks if you are into that kind of style while you're at home or buying some of the pieces that you may need to add and you can wear them in several different outfits again do not buy anything and you only have one outfit in mind think of several different outfits when you are making any purchases that's from me or anyone else and that way you're getting your money's worth with all of your wardrobe you're able to exchange and interchange anything and still use the items that you have in your closet without feeling like you have to go and purchase something for a new outfit you're actually moving things around in different outfits for that season and you're using it so much more and you're getting your money honey it's it's working for you okay so i hope you guys enjoyed this fall outfit style videos for big bellies and uh yeah Talk to me in the comments. What do you think? What are some other things you want to see during this season that you want me to style? We've done blazers, sneakers, flats, boots. We've done bodysuits, all the things. So definitely chat with me about that. Um, I will see you guys in the comments there. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and I'll chat with you guys later. Bye.